Sidewalks are everybody else's responsibility, and Minneapolis wants to make sure you're getting out to shovel your sidewalk. John Croman explains why the city is getting tough on shoveling. Two decades in Minneapolis, I know the sidewalk drill. The question's always timing. The trouble is, if you shovel too early, you'll have to shovel again. Shovel too late, then the dog walkers have already been out and stepped on it, and then it's harder to shovel. That glowing orb can only do so much, and even a little bit of unshoveled snow can become treacherous. You find yourself doing the no shovel shuffle over somebody else's frozen footprints. Winter comes every year. It's no surprise. City Council member Andrew Johnson's had it with the sidewalk slackers. A lot of residents out there. It only takes one person not shoveling, and a block suddenly becomes impassable. In the past, the city relied on neighbors to call 311 and report unshoveled walks. That system's still in place but this year they'll be sending inspectors out. Seeing which homes don't shovel and making sure they let people know right away, hey, you got to keep up with this. This is your responsibility. Worst comes to worst, the city will send a contractor to shovel your walk and bill you. Average price, 150 bucks. We're going to have support systems in place for seniors or those with physical limitations. Some say the city should just take things over and plow sidewalks the same way they plow the streets. But it's not like digging out TCF Stadium. We're talking about a town with nearly 2,000 miles of sidewalks. Price tag for that takeover, $20 million. Yeah, it's about this time every year I start thinking, maybe this will be the year I get a snowblower. And that's not going to happen. In Minneapolis, John Croman, Care 11 News.